Hello YouTube, Skyward Entertainment's here. I'm back with another video and you read the title. We're going to be installing the Impact Client for Minecraft Java Edition today. Now we're not going to be installing the Impact Client with the Optifine because for some reason that never actually worked for me. So yeah, without any further ado, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so installing the Impact Client is actually much easier than you probably think it is. So let's just go ahead and open up your web browser and type in impactclient.net. The link will be in the description down below if you're too lazy to type it in. Go ahead and click on the Downloads tab over here. Download it for Java if you have Java installed and if you don't or just simply don't know, then just download the Impact Installer for Windows as it's just always a safe bet. Now we're just going to wait for this to download. Uh, if it asks you if you want to keep it, then of course keep it. It's actually a safe file. Windows is just paranoid for some reason. And we're just going to wait for this to install. Okay, so once it has installed, you just want to click on the show and folder button, then double click the file. And it should load up eventually sometime maybe uh, if this pops up here you want to click on run if you don't see run down here then you're gonna have to click on more info there should be a tab over here and then click on run anyways it's totally safe trust me it's just that windows parent is paranoid because well you know it's changing minecraft files right so now what you want to do is select the version of minecraft that you want to install impact for in my case, it will be 1.15.2 because I already have it for 1.12. Uh, select latest over here and make sure that no is selected for Optifine down here. Uh, leave this as it is and uh, I guess you can leave this too. So just click on the install tab over here and then click on OK. Uh, if it doesn't work for you, then one reason might be that you haven't ran the version of Minecraft that you're installing the Impact Installer for. So, for example, if I want to download it for 1.12, but I never ran version 1.12 before, even if I have run 1.12.2, uh, then it still won't work because you need to make sure that you've ran 1.12 specifically. But of course, that's an example. You don't actually need it to run 1.12, right? So just go ahead and close out of this tab. You can go ahead and delete this over here and close this out over here again. Click on the Minecraft tab. Uh, to open the Minecraft launcher and it should be selected over here automatically if you don't see it however you need to click on the installations tab up here click on new click on the version and scroll down till you find impact 1.15 or just whichever version that you downloaded it for obviously uh, you can name it whatever you need uh, yeah. <laughs> and click on create down here then click on the play tab again and make sure that it is selected over here so you just click on this and find the installation so there it is i'm gonna click on play and i'll be right back once i load into a world okay so here i am in the world as you can see Everything is working, uh, I've got these pigs and stuff outlined, and yeah, as you can see, uh, I clearly have the impact installer or client thing installed, and yeah, I'm not going to go into detail on how to use all this stuff over here, but if you click the uh, left, no wait, right, no, left, right, right shift button, uh, then this tab over here will pop up and you can change all the settings and stuff. And uh, yeah, so that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please click the like button and subscribe if it really helped you or you just want to subscribe for some reason. And yeah, so see you next time. I'm out. Mm -hmm.